Hi there, it's Josh Colbeck here from Advanced Coupons. In this video, you're going to learn how to apply a free product whenever you apply a coupon in WooCommerce. And this is great for giving your customers a free gift with their purchase. So in the default WooCommerce, it's actually really difficult to achieve this. And I want to show you a new tool today called Advanced Coupons, advancedcouponsplugin.com. And this will actually allow you to do this quite easily. And also beyond that, you can restrict the coupon depending on certain conditions in the cart, you know, whether they've got certain products or products from a certain category or whether they've ordered something before. Um, you can do all of that with the advanced coupons plugin. So I have set up a, a demo site here and this is just a, a, like a blank WooCommerce installation with the storefront theme. And I've imported a bunch of the, uh, the default products here. Uh, that come with WooCommerce um, for their demos. So I'm going to go into the back end here and I already have advanced coupons plugin installed. So let's go to the coupon section and add a coupon. So you'll notice here on the left hand side immediately, uh, there's a lot more options than your, your sort of bog standard WooCommerce installation. So this is all the, the different features that we, uh, the advanced coupons plugin adds to your coupons if you have it installed. So I'm going to call this one, let's call this one free product because we're going to demonstrate how to add a free product when you, um, when you apply a coupon. So the section that we want here is called add free products. So there's a little tab here, add free products, and you can just search for any kind of product there. Tell it what quantity that you want to add it into the cart when this coupon is applied. And it will add that product or products um, and zero out the, the cost of the product. So this is fantastic for, for running you know, promotions. We can use it to add products that you want to track the inventory for and you also want to sell separately. But you might want to add that product when there's a, another type of product into the cart. So an example of that might be um, you know, a, a kit, like an assembly kit or something like that that would go along with some main product that you sell. Uh, you can also do it for promotional reasons. So like say if you had um, somebody adding a, a laptop into their shopping cart, you might want to give them a free mouse. So that, that's the kind of thing that you can do with this, with this plugin uh, and with this particular feature for adding free products. So let's uh, let's go and find some products. I want to add. Uh, I want to create a deal here just so I can show you how it actually works. So I'll look for a nice low cost, well, look at an easy item that would be able to be given away. Let's go with this belt here. So we want to give away a free belt, and it's sim as simple as this. We just search for the product by name. We'll go away and find that and I just tell it how many of that item I want to give away. And you can add multiple items in here if you wish. Um, generally though, you're probably only adding one in to satisfy a deal. So that is, is fully functional. So I'm going to hit publish now and whenever I add this product, it will add that belt into the cart. So this is, uh, this is all ready to go. But what you're probably most wanting to do is restrict this coupon so that it only can be applied when certain conditions are met in the cart. So we call these cart conditions. So cart conditions can be set on this little tab here and you can add a condition group. So you can group different types of conditions together. You can chain them and, um, and add different conditions all together. But uh, let's, let's have a look at the different types. So we've got uh, product quantities, pro uh, product categories exist in the cart. So it's like if a, a product with a certain category exists, you can check whether the user is logged in or out. You can check their user role. You can check uh, if they're within a certain number of hours after they've registered. So that's like after they've made their first order. You can check if they're registered. Uh, you might want to send them a follow-up offer or something. Uh, you can check uh, if they've recently made an order whether the cart has a quantity, uh, like a, th a threshold for the, the number of items in their cart, whether they hit a certain subtotal, uh, or if they've ordered an item before. So um, let's, let's do a little demonstration. I'm gonna choose this product category exists in the cart. So if we add that there, and I want to have a look at my products. So 
if we're giving away a free belt, um, maybe what we want to do is only give away that free belt if they've bought like a hoodie. So we have this hoodies category here where there's a bunch of different products in this hoodies category. And let's, let's see what we do. So if we type in hoodies here, you can see we've got the hoodies category and I can just save that cart condition and that is now active. So let's open up the site. I'm going to open up in an incognito window. With an incognito window is just a private browsing session, gives you a fresh, uh, fresh session for the site. So you can see I'm not logged in anymore. This is just like I'm viewing the site as a guest. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and we'll add a, a hoodie. So this hoodie with a zipper. I can choose any of these hoodies because they're, they're basically all in the hoodies category. Um, and that is enough to satisfy the cart conditions. So you'll see here I've added the hoodie with the zipper, but we haven't applied our deal yet. So let's add this coupon. Uh, it's free product, I think it was. Yep, free product is the coupon code. And let's apply that deal and see what happens. So the coupon code's applied successfully. We've still got the hoodie in the cart and now we've got a belt in there as well. One quantity with zero cost. So that is how you add a free product to a shopping cart in WooCommerce. And so you can give away free products, free gifts with your with a purchase, as long as they meet some sort of condition or something like that. Um, the, the range of deals that you can do with this is, is absolutely enormous. It's only limited by your imagination. So think about your store, think about how you could apply this in your store, get your customers really excited about um, earning a free product or a free sample or some sort of free item that you can give away to get them over the line and get more sales and get more revenue. So I hope this, uh, this video has helped. And if you want to go and learn more about advanced coupons plugin, just go to advanced coupons plugin.com. There'll be a link in the uh, description just below here if you're watching this on YouTube. So go ahead and go to that site, check out the video there, check out the, fe the other features because there's a lot of cool stuff that you can do with this plugin. So that's it for me now and uh, enjoy.